these instruments, uh, sculptures, make a melody from left to right or right to left. So that achieves a few things. Um, first, because it does, the, the suspenses don't look like a traditional instrument, they're inviting to non-musicians. So if you don't play music, you're probably still willing to come up and explore this strange looking thing and kind of bang around, even if it's as simple as something like this. Uh, and that's really important to my team's ethos of making music making more accessible. Um, you'll notice kind of three different ways that people tend to play these fences. Uh, and this is after installing at places like Newport Folk Festival and other 20,000 person music festivals. These are the patterns that we find. Uh, so one will be sort of a, a public solitude. So you might be walking by this path and you might see someone just kind of like poking around and kind of learning uh, and going through a process of exploration. And they might just leave it there and then place the chimes and walk along. Another is a set of musicians who ha happen upon the piece who start to kind of groove out or jam in a more organized fashion. And that's going to be uh, the demonstration that we do in a few minutes. Uh, and then the third, and one of the most rewarding for me to see, is this moment of sort of like a Promethean musical discovery, uh, which is a ridiculous phrase, but a friend of mine used it. When you see a non-musician approach this instrument, kind of bang around and start to explore, and then maybe fall into a groove with musicians who are playing with them, and they come away, usually with a smile on their face, and a clear look saying, Oh, that was actually really fun, and maybe I haven't done that in my life or in a very long time. Um, so those are sort of the three modes. Keep an eye out for them. And now, without further ado, I will invite my former professor. Um, he's to blame for much of this mess. Uh, and a very good friend of mine and composer, Robin Beyer. Um, and another friend of mine, composer, musician, video extraordinaire. Where's Justin? Yes. So we're going to do a little demonstration. <laughs> we have not composed anything, but these are very talented musicians. So you can all kind of gather around, I guess, <laughs> and we're going to explore, and you'll find a kind of undulation to our improvisation. We'll be poking around. We might find a pattern. We might groove in. We might groove out. And then eventually, I'll let them off the hook once they can't take it anymore. Um, so I'm going to invite them up. Let's all gather around. And then once we finish our more formal improvisation, if formal is the right word, uh, feel free to take some mallets and play. Please stay. Please ask me questions. Um, again, thank you to everyone who's here, to everyone who donated. This really means a lot to us. All right. So. Well, I'm going to be on the red one. Justin has no idea. We'll poke around. 